Well, imagine being in a jail for a month for a crime that you did not commit or for a joke that you did not crack. That is exactly what is happening today with stand-up comedian Mulagar Faruqi, who was arrested in Indore in Madhya Pradesh on 1st of January and has been behind bars for over a month now. He has been denied bail repeatedly by various courts at least five times in a row. The comedian is facing multiple investigation and a four-year prison term if held guilty. What was his crime, if one may ask? Well, he was going to pass derogatory remarks on Hindu deities and Union Minister Amit Shah in a show that he was hosting on January 1st in Indore. So he was arrested for a crime that he did not commit and was going to commit. Here is what happened that day. He was hosting a comedy show, as mentioned, at a 56 Dukan area in Indore when a group of people led by Eklavya Singh Gaur, who's also son of a local BJP MLA Malini Lakshman Singh Gaur, intervened and stopped the show. The mob manhandled the comedian and took him to the police station along with the organizers. He was later arrested. The audience, however, said that nothing related to religion was remotely mentioned during the show. The police station or house officer also told the media that they examined the video footage and that nothing was found to be malicious at all. There was no video evidence or any other evidence that would prove that the comedian passed derogatory remarks or comments on that day. Then why was the comedian arrested? On what basis? That's the big question. The local superintendent of police, Vijay Khatri, defended the arrest and said and told the media, in fact, that police had oral evidence against Faruqi that he was going to make the comments. He said that the complainant in this case, Gore, allegedly heard the comedian making derogatory comments on Hindu deities and union minister while he was rehearsing for the show and before the show was about to begin. What is interesting, however, that the FIR did not mention any specific remarks that the comedian or his associates made during the rehearsal. Khatri also praised uh, Iklavya Gaur for being active and alert. He said that it doesn't matter if Farooqi and his associates did not crack the joke in the show as he intended to do so. He also said that the video from April 2020, another video from April 2020, proved Farooqi's intent. माधुरी में पहले से शक है वो गाना है तेरा करू गिन गिन तो उसको लगा वनवास गिन रही है साल चौदह पे रुक गई <laughs> मैं टीवी पे देख रहा था द बर्निंग ट्रेन तो डैड आए एंड डैड इज लाइक ये बकवास मत देखा कर उन्होंने चैनल बंद कर दिया एंड आज लाइक क्यों ऐसा इज लाइक ये गोदरा कांड का वीडियो है न्यूज चैनल चल रहा है लाइक मुझे तो लगा कोई मूवी चल रही है डायरेक्टर बाय अमित शाह समथिंग प्रोड्यूस बाय आर एस एस कुछ पता नहीं ले तो मैं दिस वीडियो रिसीव्ड Backlash, FIR against Faruqi, and hashtags demanding his arrest back then. But the comedian was not arrested back in April. What's even more surprising is that although the evidence was not found against the comedian on first, this time around, the Court of Justice also approved the arrest and supported the arrest. On January 11, the additional district and sessions court judge denied Faruqi bail. The Madhya Pradesh High Court in its last hearing on 28th of January also posed questions on Murnavar Farooqi's mindset behind the alleged jokes and said that he must not be spared. I would once again like to bring to your notice that this is just on the basis of an oral complaint by Eklavya Singh Gaur. There is no evidence, there is nothing to prove that the comments were made by the comedian and his associates during the rehearsal. Yet, he has been behind bars for over a month.